Hey guys, it's Nate, aka The Foot Accountant. Welcome back to the channel for a footies market talk video. Footies is here. We have a lot of cards back into packs. Basically, it's going to be structured, at least by the way that they have told us, it's going to be structured similar to how it was in the years past. So, um, if I'm going to pull up the, um, the web page today, this is the loading screen that we have up right now. I'm going to pull up the web page. We're going to look at a few things that's going to be going on during footies, um, kind of like the promo info, as if you will. Um, we've got the Lozano player pick that we have to do, and I, you can't see it over here, but we do have some packs. We have 12 packs that I have saved up that I'm just going to be opening kind of in the background as I talk about stuff uh, throughout this video. We'll open this here in a second, but first I want to talk about FIFA 19 footies. A lot of you guys probably know what's going on so far, so I'll keep this quick. Um, but then I want to kind of talk about the market and kind of see where things are at. A ton of prices just hit the absolute floor today. It was kind of awesome to watch. So here we are in FIFA 19 footies. It's going to go from July 3rd until August 14th. So it's going to be a long time. This promo is going to run for a very, very long time. And there are going to be a lot of stuff back into packs. So obviously we're going to have the footies cards. There's going to be voting. The first five weeks of the campaign, you'll be able to vote for footies in multiple categories. Uh, on those select days, we'll have a player pick, which is exactly what we have here with um, Gelson Martins, Lozano. I forget the third guy, but Lozano's going to win, guaranteed. Um, and you will basically, that's how we vote uh, for those cards. Then there's also the best of packs. Now, I want to look and see and show you guys who is in this best of packs right now. And this is out for the first uh, two weeks. So these cards are going to be in packs for two weeks. So that is a kind of a long time. It looks like they're kind of switching this up. Then when this first batch goes out of packs, the second batch will go in on the 17th. Then the third batch will go in on the 31st all the way through August 14th. So this is a pretty long promo. It's like a six-week promo, basically, which is pretty dope. They're also going to be re-releasing re SBCs, best of SBCs. Hopefully, they make them a little bit cheaper than they were when they originally came out. That would be nice to have a little bit of a discount there. And, of course, the reward pack. A lot of you guys got 125k packs today when they dropped. I got one as well, didn't get anything. And then of course, uh, the weekly objectives. But I wanna talk about what the best of packs really are. I wanna kinda of look through this. And this is this cracks me up. This webpage honestly cracks me up because this is definitely, this is Foot Economist. If you guys know who Foot Economist is, I almost guarantee you that he put this together. This is so funny to see a spreadsheet from EA uh, that definitely has to be the doing of Foot Economist. So GG's to you on that one, dude. Um, but basically they put in some of the team of the group stage cards just a select few of them though Which is kind of interesting. There's not all of them just a few of them We have most of the foot birthday squad and then all of the ones to watches and Then basically not all of them, but most of the road to the final cards, which is very interesting as well Basically all the road to the finals some ultimate screams and then some man of the match and hero cards Which were like selectively random um, which was very very interesting you see a lot of these guys that are gone, like you have the Messi Man of the Match card, the UCL Man of the Match, um, and then some the Di Maria, a lot of random cards in here, and this is really, really messing with the market on all different levels. And then Team of the Week 1 to 2, you have uh, some of these guys in here as well. So, or one, Team of the Week 1 to whatever. So uh, some of these guys weren't in Team of the Week 1 to 2, but there are some pretty sick cards in packs right now. And this is going to be fantastic for crafting. Um, and you know all the cards that we got today from the footies promo there's going to be a lot of crafting that's going to be able to be done uh, because of this we're going to look at a few prices here in a second but i am going to be starting off with opening the packs in the background just so we get something going balde dial was the other one that we wanted but lozano is definitely going to win this uh we're going to store him in the club that is our vote for lozano now i want to show you guys what kind of happens when you open these packs i have a ones to watch uh, guaranteed player here at the end. It guarantees a wants to watch player. I'm gonna do some of those, um, but you know I'm not gonna do too many of them. But basically, what I want to show you guys is there's so many special cards in packs right now. You get a special card like almost every other pack. It seems it's crazy, crazy stuff. And that's gonna also kind of change some things on the market um, in terms of in investing actually in a few of these cards. And I, we're talking about the high rateds that I told you guys to um, stock up on earlier this week, um, we have an interesting situation with those cards now 
because of all these cards that are in packs. So basically you can do SBCs right now, League SBCs, until we get upgrades. It's really about just trying to get packs because some people, depending on your luck, you can actually go in to the store, rip packs with coins, and get special cards out of those packs and make your money back on those packs. It's really crazy. So hopefully I can show you through these packs that you can get some good stuff. Now, I don't have too many uh, superb packs, to be honest. I don't have the best packs in here, but I would like to get a couple walkouts. We do get our first board. It is not a special player, but it is a board. 84 rated Leno, nice. And that's one thing that I do wanna talk about in this like mini pack opening market talk video. We're just gonna be all over the place talking about stuff. 284s, nice, that's a GG. Um, high rated golds right now are in a very, very interesting situation because so many of them are out of packs and you just have a lot of special cards that are in packs right now. So we're gonna take a look at some special cards that are actually good investments for high rated golds. Um, for SBCs because they're going to be re-releasing SBCs during this promo They might be changing the requirements to require some of these cards that they're putting in packs but they also just might require some higher rated squads and Right now a lot of the high rated golds are low because these higher rated special cards are low as well We do get a walk out here. Who is this? This is the ones to watch flair Socrates 86 rated we will take that man, 86 rated Socrates. And that's the one thing that I wanna mention. Through this promo, we have an incredible opportunity to again, craft SBCs. If we get that 81, double pl 81 plus guarantee promo, um, we're gonna have tons of stuff to do, tons of packs to open and everything like that through the rest of the year because there's gonna be special cards and packs through the rest of the year, which I'm really, really excited for and we get ourselves a Socrates right there. Seven packs to go. And that's just the kind of stuff that you get. Like that was that was a medium level pack. No walkout on this one. Is it a board and a special card though? It is not. But your, your probability of getting special cards now from these packs is just risen so much because there's, they said there's over 200 special cards uh, in packs. And some of their prices today, we're gonna look at prices here in a second. Some of their prices today have absolutely tanked and it's it's honestly incredible. It is honestly incredible to see and to look at. Um, if we don't get anything like a flare or whatever from these packs, I'm just going to skip them and continue on because we want to keep this moving and keep this rolling. I'm going to open this pack and also going to open up a squad on Footbin. It is not a walkout. Unfortunate, it is not a special player either. So the main two teams that are in packs right now are the Foot Birthday cards. Uh, that's an 84 rated are the foot birthday cards and the UCL lives Those are kind of the cards that have taken the biggest hit and are Honestly, just crazy crazy low in price at the moment. I'm gonna have to discard them, which is unfortunate But I want you to take a look at these foot birthday cards right here Move the screen over so you can see a little bit better Crazy drops on these cards and Bappe was like 900k. He's down 715 this Griezmann card 400,000 coins Look, look at this drop off, 788 to 400K. And this card's in packs for two weeks because that's why a lot of people were looking at these cards like, yo, I can maybe invest in these. They're gonna get um, a bunch of supply from Weekend League Rewards today and they're gonna maintain that low price. They're gonna be packed throughout the week. They're, they might have hit their lowest point right now, maybe to, uh, today during Weekend League Rewards, they might hit their lowest point because there's a lot of packs that were open in the last couple of days. But some of these price drops are just insane. And I'm really intrigued with some of these cards because of the position changes. Now, I don't see a ton of them in here that I like for uh, investments for like a low a rating investment for like an SBC. Um, but if we go to the UCL Lives right here, Tagliafico, 87 rated card for 17K, 15K on PlayStation, 15K for this card. Look what this is doing to the high rated golds. 87s are down at 17, 18 K. 88 rated are 22, 23, 24 K. I got an 88 rated. Where is this man? We're gonna find him. UCL Live squad number two. No, where'd it go? UCL Live squad number two. This is what I wanna show you guys. The second UCL Live squad, this Rebich right here. 17 K for an 88 rated card. Look what that is doing to the 88 rated cards prices uh, on this game right now. It's ridiculous, man. Absolutely. Ridiculous, and that's why 
Um, oh, this is a 50k pack. Oh, I didn't see that. 50k pack. Come on, man. It's a walkout. Let's go. Show me something big. Come on, EA. Uh, wants to watch. Ooh, a UCL Live Spanish center back Nacho Fernandez. So there's an 87. Whoa, 91 PK. Oh, baby. That's huge. I thought that was going to be the center back. I saw Barcelona and I had a second a second thought. 91 rated PK. See, that's what you can get from these packs. How much is he going for right now? I guarantee you it's not much. He's going for 51,000 coins for a 91 rated card. That's incredible, boys. But that's the thing that you can get from these packs. I just opened up a 50k pack and I get this PK who's also a 50k. So it's crazy. There might be special cards behind this as well from a 50k pack. There isn't, unfortunately, but 91 rated PK, dude. That's insane. Oh, it's untradeable as well. This is an untradeable 50k pack. What is this from? That's awesome for SVCs. And that's the thing that you can get from a lot of these packs. And that's why I'm so excited for upgrade packs because PK himself is not terribly hard to pack, you know, as a high rated card. But... You get that extra couple ratings, it's an insane pull. And that, you're just going to get pulls like that continually, continually throughout the week opening packs. Whether you're grinding League SBCs or even if you're grinding gold upgrade packs, there's a lot of opportunity to pack some cool stuff with all the special cards that are in packs. And this is why it is fun at the end of the year to get cards like this. Another walkout. Let's go. This is in our last actual pack. What is this? Foot birthday. Let's go. French? Center back, Theo Hernandez. Is this Theo Hernandez? What is his name? 86 rated though, dudes. Again, just random stuff that you see like this coming out of packs. A random foot birthday card. I don't know if this trap pack is tradable or not. Oh, and also a Denayer man of the match item. You know what? We'll take it. That card, instead of getting his gold card, which quick sells for 600 coins, we get this special card that's quick sells for 14k. And this Hernandez card, I think I have Foot Birthday open still. I do. This card is 27,000 coins. You know what? It's tradable. I know it's barely worth anything, but I'm going to take the money on this card. I mean, exactly. I just made 30, 40,000 coins off of this pack. What does it say? 27K? I'll listen like 25, open bid. Same thing with this. I bet this Denier card is discard. I bet it's definitely discard. Oh, yeah, it's discard. We're going to quick sell him. Send the rest of those guys to the club. But dude, that is a GG from, honestly, from these packs. I mean, I made 50K, you know, I probably made 120, 130K back from those packs that I opened from just a few special cards. And I did marquee matchups for 30K and uh, part of that Africa SBC. But we do now, oh man, this one's to watch player. It's not even a walkout, dude. French left mid, who is it? Lamar? Thomas Lamar. All right, we're going to rinse that one. Uh, but again, the market is going to be crazy. Now, I, won't, I do want to tell you guys something. I am still going to be talking about the market, but I'm going to talk about the market in a way that, um, you know, I'm not too worried about making coins for the rest of this year. And I hope you guys aren't too, too worried about that either. Trading has kind of taken a backseat now to just having fun. That's what we're going to do now on the game. Yes, we see these high rated gold prices. We see Isco at 30k, Aguero at 30k. Aguero is in packs right now. This card is out of packs and this card has dropped this much. Go stock your club. If you didn't before, you're actually in the money because you're, you can do it for cheaper now. 86 rated are like 13k. Go out and stock your club. 85s, 84s, 86s, all the way up to 89s. Just go and do it. Get ready for SBCs because there are going to be a lot of SBCs for this promo um, and a lot of other market movements. So you'll be able to make coins if you want to. But what I'm focusing on, focusing on is just ripping packs, man. Ripping packs, tradable or untradable. We're going to have weekend league rewards this morning on stream. If you're watching this video, check my Twitch link down in the description. I might be live right now. Might be live streaming some rewards. But all these special cards in packs, now is the time to have Fun. And if you're somebody who has been looking at one of these cards for your team, let's say you've been wanting Diamonds and Sanchez road to the final for your team, but you didn't want to shell out the 273k, you can now get him for 150,000 coins. So that is one big positive that I do see from this promo. Let's say you wanted this right wing Griezmann card for your team. He was 800k. Now he's 
400. He's under 400k. So much stuff just got a lot more affordable. Yes, some people lo lose coins on some of these cards that they had in their clubs and they were using in their teams. But still, man, this is really, really fun with all this stuff in packs. It just gives us an opportunity to do packs. But here I will give you one word of warning. I do not recommend going in here and ripping these types of packs. We'll do... Uh, Let's do, let's do one right now. Some people have been saying that you can rip the 7,500 coin packs and make your money back. I don't think that is really true. Obviously, if you hit one of those ones to watches though, even discard one, they discard for like what? 10, 12K and you pay 7,500 for the pack. So there is an opportunity for you to make your coins back on some of these cards. I'll do one more. But I don't really think this is a method that works unless you have insane, insane pack luck, which I don't. So... The PK was nice though, and so was that uh, Foot Birthday Hernandez card. So, again, boys, footies is here. Footies is here. We're having fun. It's all about the packs. It honestly really is. But I'm going to title this video a Market Talk because we are talking about stuff on the market. Um, but we're also um, just having fun with the game, and that's what I really wanted to talk to you guys about today. Build those teams. Play Weekend League, for goodness sake. A lot of people now are seeing what's in packs, and they're going to see Weekend League Wars like, man. I missed out on Weekend League Rewards today. Well, you know, you, you, you kind of did. You kind of did a little bit. Now, for the rest of the market that is not in packs, Team of the Years, they did say, will not be in the packs. They will not come out in packs. Some of these cards did have a little bit of panic today. They had a little bit of a panic sell, but it looks like most of them have rebounded, uh, except for this Mbappe. But Mbappe has so many special cards, you know, it's ridiculous. He's like 3-5 something, 3-6-4. Ronaldo, what are you chilling at right now? See, some of these cards dropped a little bit. Some of them dropped more than others. It just kind of depends on the, the value and the, the hype of the card as well. Some of these cards could drop a little bit more, you know, but it's just a fun time in the game. We're not worried about card prices. We're not worried about making coins. You can be worried about that if you want to, but you're going to be in the minority. Right now, it's just time to have fun, to open packs. Um, but I will recommend, make sure you do play Weekend League because... You do get some good packs. The most efficient way to be getting packs is obviously through the squad building challenge section. That's going to be the easiest way to get packs. You can honestly grind these any once to watch SPCs if you want to, because you can. I'm going to go put Lamar in right now. Let's just do this. I'll do one for the video. Open this up. Um, but you can just honestly you can grind this SBC. Like I'm going to put this Lamar card that I just packed. I'm going to throw him in. We're going to throw in some gold players, all right? We're just going to throw in some gold players, fill out the rest of the squad, and you can do this squad for literally like 5K. You need, you need six rare players, and you can have another once to watch player. So I'm going to try to stack a bunch of these, try to hit a Ronaldo, try to hit a Higuain, and this is great for crafting capabilities as well. If you're somebody who likes to craft, if you're somebody who likes to um do Icon SBCs, I still have some SBCs that I want to craft and that I want to finish out. I'm going to be looking to, you know, get some of these cards uh, from the SBC, from this Once to Watch Upgrade SBC, and put them into this team. I could have done this a little bit more efficiently. I'm seeing that right now. But it's okay. I would just, boys, this is what I want to tell you. This Market Talk video today, this is my biggest advice for you. Have freaking fun with the game, all right? Just have fun. Spend a little bit of coins. If you're somebody who doesn't have a ton of coins, that's okay. That's okay. Look at this, rare player six. I need one more rare player. Can we get him in right there? 50 cam, boom. I'm turning this in for any ones to watch player. If you don't have any coins right now, you can make a little bit of coins, bidding, flipping, you know, the usual stuff we talk about. You can use that to make some coins, especially trading with League SBC silvers right now because people are doing League SBCs to get packs. But here we go, boys. Can we get a walkout? We can. Anyone's to watch pack. Show me that Portugal flag and be Ronaldo. That is what I want. Italian striker Balotelli. Not terrible. 85 rated one swatch card. We can go do an SBC with that. So I'm hoping for the repeatable upgrade SBCs. That's what everybody is hoping for. Um, but footies is here, boys. Footies has started. And we're going to have a lot more probably pack opening videos. We're going to do packs on the stream. Um, when I'm streaming live, we'll still look at the market. We'll still look at a lot of SPC stuff But now is the time of the game that you want to have your coins liquid I was gonna buy Ronaldo for my team, but I am totally fine with rolling 
um, with Fernando Torres at striker or a lesser player at striker so that I can have a couple million coins uh, to mess around with packs with. You know, we're going to have some fun at the end of this game. I'm glad that they brought out footies like they did this year. Um, and I'm just excited to see where they go with the rest of this content for the rest of footies. It's a long promo. There's going to be a ton of stuff in packs. There's going to be a lot of SBCs, a lot of other market movements. But is the, now is just the time to have fun, boys. All right. If you enjoyed this video, smash a thumbs up on it. Comment down below if you have any questions. And subscribe to the channel if you're new. It's been Nate, the Foot Accountant. Catch you guys later. Peace out.